Hey guys, this is Austin over at Hoover Automotive here in uh, Somerville, South Carolina. And today I have a brand new 2023 Jeep Grand Cherokee L that I want to give you a walk around tour on. Enjoy the video. So starting right up here with the front end styling of the 2023 uh, Grand Cherokee L, you can see you've got full LED headlights as well as daytime running lights. This one particularly has the blackout package. So you've got a blacked out grill, blacked out headlamps, blacked out bumpers, um, black accents everywhere. With the white coloring, looks really, really great. I'd call it a stormtrooper look because you've got a ton of white with all the black accenting. Looks really, really good. You've also got the historic Wagoneer style grill where it's slanted forward just like the old Wagoneer from the late 70s looks really really amazing coming around the side you've got the iconic 20 inch five spoke design that jeep has become known for over the years looks really really great that blackout package blacks out those wheels with a triple diamond coat uh, appearance there same thing on your mirror caps those are blacked out and your grand cherokee badge right here right here you can see an american flag on both sides it does point backwards because this is a truly patriotic vehicle it's built in ohio designed in michigan and sold all over the u.s Let's go ahead to the back of the vehicle and check out what's back there. All right, here we are at the back of the Grand Cherokee L. You can see you've got your full LED tail lights with turn signals and daytime running lights back here. You also have LED license plate lights. Like I said, it has the blackout pack. So black Jeep badge, a black L badge, which this is going to be your telltale that this is a three row SUV as well as the roof line. The two row has a buttress, a flying buttress roof. This one has a regular SUV roof. You've also, this is the limited trim level. So you've got your limited trim level badge right here. And then you've got a cover for your tow hitch. This vehicle is capable of towing 6,200 pounds. Popping the rear gate, of course, it's power. Pops right up with a nice beep. With the third row up, you've got about 18 inches of cargo room back here with storage underneath the floor. This is going to be really similar to the Durango storage. So if you're uh, familiar with the size in there, this is very similar. You do have more storage, however, underneath here as well as on each side. Um, so absolute tons of storage. The seats fold nice and easily by pulling these two levers. And you can see with this third row down, you've got tons of room, just over four feet of uh, length and about four feet of width. So it's a huge cargo area with a ton of room. You can also see from here some of the amenities that the third row includes, like your USB ports and air vents right there. Let's go head back here and see how comfortable this third row really is. First thing we'll talk about heading into the third row is how to get to the third row. You do have these nice tip and slide seats, which are really great because if you do have a car seat or something here, it can stay in place. You can slide it all the way forward and it gives you a huge entryway and there's two ways to step in. you got a step here and a step here. Climbing in is nice and easy. The uh, floor is nice and low so your knees aren't in your face. You do have a lot of amenities back here, for example, cup holders, USB ports, and air vents to keep you nice and comfortable. Um, you do have really nice high quality leather seats back here. So a lot of uh, SUVs, especially in the size category, will cheap out on the third row seats, make them a lesser quality uh, seating material. Not here in the Grand Cherokee Alp. Right above that, we do have our fan cam, which is a 360 degree camera system, which allows you to see all four seats from the center display so that you can check on your youngsters and see exactly how they're doing. Let's go ahead into the second row of seats and check out those ones. So here we are in the second row of seats of the Grand Cherokee L, a very comfortable place to be. The seats do both slide forward and back and they recline and incline. Looking in the center, you have a separate zone of climate here, which you can adjust the fan speed and temperature. You've got two air vents here and two air vents on the uh, pillar here. Also in this center stack, you've got a regular house 10, 110 house plug right here, as well as two USB-Cs, two USB-As, and two cup holders with storage on each of the backs of the seat. Above us, we've got the big panoramic sunroof, which stretches over the second row, providing you with tons of room, and it does have a power shade so that if it's too sunny, you can shut it off, won't even know it's there. Let's go ahead up to the front seats and talk about the amenities up there. All right, so here we are on the front seat of the Grand Cherokee L, and it is genuinely luxurious. This is just the limited trim. It's about halfway up the trim ladder, and you can see we've got genuine leather with stitching and wood trim all over. Tons of displays and screens and technology in here. For example, adaptive cruise control on your steering wheel, a digital gauge cluster right here with lane keeping assist, and then a huge 10 and a half inch Uconnect 5 display that has wireless Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, built-in Alexa, 
and I will demo the fam cam for you so you can see exactly what's going on. You can click on the seat individually and see exactly what's going on in that seat so that you can keep an eye on your youngsters. You can X out of that and you can fold your third row headrest for better visibility. On your steering wheel, you do have the wood trim as well as metal accenting built right in. Then you've got buttons here for multiple displays. You can configure this screen however you want. You can have the radio, you can have navigation, you can have your miles per gallon, you can have your speed, and any information on the vehicle that you might want, like tire pressure monitoring, battery voltage, oil pressure, all that stuff. Moving behind that, you've got a nice felt line, easy to hold your phone storage area with USBs as well as a 12 volt. Behind that, you've got your shifter, which by the way, there is a cover for this storage area to keep it all looking nice and smooth. Two cup holders behind that, a leather wrapped stitched armrest right here with two tiers of storage, a top tier here for a wallet, some money, some knickknacks, whatever you might want, or a bigger pocket down below for a bunch of different types of things that you might want to put in there, for example, a large purse. Right above that, up here in the middle, you do have an auto dimming mirror right here in the center, as well as a sunglass holder. Your controls for your glass on your sunroof, as well as the power shade. Your power lift gate behind that with your uh, SOS and assist buttons right there. And of course, your interior lighting. Over on the passenger side, you can see your glove box. Tons of storage in there with your books. And all of that. Let's go head under the hood. So here we are underneath the hood of the Grand Cherokee L. And this is the base motor. It is a 3.6 liter Pentastar V6. Makes around 300 horsepower, 365 pound-feet of torque and it can be delivered to either the rear wheels like it is in this configuration or all four wheels through a series of three different four-wheel drive systems. There is a full off-road package that will give you air suspension, locking differentials, and a low-range transfer case. Um, all of that is available on the Grand Cherokee and Grand Cherokee L. Looking underneath this engine bay though, I'm gonna go over some maintenance items for you. You can see your fuse box with your battery right here, your coolant reservoir right here, your oil dipstick here, your engine air intake right over here, your oil fill here, and you'll notice there's no power steering fluid. This vehicle has a closed loop power steering fluid. It is no maintenance required for the life of the vehicle. Right over here is the only thing that you should have to touch though, because this vehicle comes equipped with our lifetime powertrain warranty. Unlimited mileage, unlimited years. It's good through Allies, so you can take it to any dealership in the country, regardless of brand, and they'll be able to take care of you with only a $200 deductible. Let's go talk around the side of the vehicle and go over some other stuff. Thank you guys for watching this video and spending some time with us. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and leave comments on what vehicles you want to see next. Also, feel free to check out our website, hooverjeepchrysler.net. You can see what's currently on its way to our dealership, in stock at our dealership, or you can even order through our website. Our uh, salespeople would be more than happy to set up their express purchase through our website as well. You can also give us a phone call right at the phone number down below. Our sales staff would be more than happy to answer any questions that you have as well as schedule a test drive um, for you to be able to drive the vehicle and see all of its features in person. With that said, thanks for watching and have a great day.